But before that, I want you to see what we can see from here. Um, we will talk about it soon. It looks like it's going to be a long video, maybe because I feel the energy. When you are leaving that place, do it slowly. People like to fall here, and we don't want to do that. Oh, the smell is absolutely lovely. This is a beautiful mosaic from um, the year 2000, around it. You see the Golgotha, we just visited that place. The name Golgotha is, uh, is um, you can find it only in the New Testament, the Jews and other sources didn't mention that place. Golgotha can be the place that, of the crucifixion. And there's so many people die there, then you might see some skulls. Some believe that the skull belongs to uh, the first man ever, Adam, Adam and Eve, and I uploaded lately a video of it, but people actually started to laugh at me. How can it be? There's so many questions, uh, question marks in, in, uh, in, uh, um, in everything, but if you believe, why not to believe that he was buried there or moved to here, whatever? If so many people believe in it, don't laugh at it, accept it. Maybe it's not your way, but it's their way. Here, you can see that they purified the body of, of Jesus after the crucifixion. You can see um, Joseph over Ramitia and Nakdimon, we will talk about him soon. John, the disciple. Why John? Because he's got no beer. This is the only one without beer. Mary, the mother. And Mary Magdalene holding her hair. She's the only woman in, uh, in, in Christian art that you can see her hair. Then everyone is doing it. Uh, every Jew. They will purify this body. They will cover, cover it with shrouds. And they will bury him in that uh, story in a cave. Why in a cave? Because Joseph of Aramitia was a rich man. He could afford himself to give Jesus his own tomb, which was next to the crucifixion place, according to the book of John. Then we're going to visit, we're going to visit the tomb soon, but first, one of the most important uh, energy point in that church is where they purified his body, which is right here. Let's go to the other side. Because of the sun location, belongs to the Armenian, the Catholic, and the Greek Orthodox. And now, this is the most important place to bless my souvenirs and cover it with oil. Mainly because the naked body of Jesus touch that place. That is the anointing stone. Are you ready to go to the tomb? Yeah, of course. Let's do that. On the way, if you didn't subscribe my channel, this is the time to do that. And uh, ring the bell. And you will be able to see uh, the newest videos of mine. I'm trying to upload at least once a day, one a day. I hope that I will be able to continue with it. That is the Armenian Chapel. That is where... The three ladies, according to the Armenians, what's Jesus being crucified?
And that is the place that I'm lighting candles for the one who asked me. If he wants to know how to do that, go to my description and there's a link for buy me a coffee and I will do that happily.